A band traveling from Denver through Albuquerque is now stranded after their van was broken into twice in 48 hours. News 13's Ariana Kraft shares their chaotic journey as they try to finish their tour. The Stews is a rock band from Auburn, Alabama, traveling in the Southwest on their summer tour. We were kind of like a baby project during the pandemic. Sprung out of that. Things were going well, but the tour took a turn when the band was burglarized in Colorado. And we'd already been in Denver for a show and came back to drop some friends off at the airport. Um, and that's when we got broken into the first night. Four guitars were stolen, but the band had to keep moving to make it to their shows in Dallas. The group made an overnight stop in Albuquerque at the Holiday Inn Express on Alameda. We wanted to come to New Mexico and see some of the sights and see how beautiful it is because it truly is. But bad luck struck a second time when their van was broken into again. And I woke up fairly early the next morning, came down and our window was smashed and our ignition was torn and everything was gone at that point. This guitar was taken, a chord acoustic guitar covered in stickers. There's a priceless sentimental value on the stuff stolen. I mean, so many songs written, gigs played, um, just everyday stuff, you know? Right now, the band is at a standstill. The thieves destroyed the van's ignition and steering wheel while trying to steal the van and trailer altogether. So right now we're stuck in Albuquerque, kind of waiting on the dealership to tell us um, if we need to order in special parts and if we do, how long that's going to take. Preston Hall, the lead singer of the band, says they're not going to let this slow them down. But at the end of the day, it is just, um, just you know, guitars and stuff, and it's not going to hold us back from, you know, keep going, so we got to get to Dallas. Ariana Kraft, KRQE News 13. APD is investigating the theft. Band members say altogether they lost more than $10,000 in equipment. The students have a GoFundMe set up as they try to finish their summer tour.